How you doing folks? This is Tony with uh, Getting Back to the Basics. <clears throat> um, I did a video a while back um, talking about the beam machine that I had gotten for Christmas and I had a little bit of a problem with it. Um, it has too much play in it and it's supposed to ride on a 2x4 and I had milled a piece of uh, sweet gum and it did not do what it was supposed to do so let me I'm gonna flip the camera around here and you'll see what uh, my dilemma is so here's the beam machine <clears throat> and this is a 2x4 and actually if anybody knows anything when you go to Home Depot or Lowe's or anywhere these are not actually two inches by four inches they're an inch and a half by three and a half and if you look right here this is three and a half inches. I probably have, well, let me get on the other side here so you can see it because I got a shadow there. So if you look right here, I probably have about a quarter inch. So you see the play I got? So when I'm cutting, and if I don't have that thing 100% straight, when I'm cutting, this is what I get. So we see a gouge right here, and this is from where it's not cutting straight. Have another gouge here, have another gouge here. And if you flip it around, <clears throat> you can see what we have. We have gouges and gouges and gouges. This, <clears throat> this could have been a good beam. The problem is I couldn't use it. So I had to go back, and I made me <clears throat> a little jig that will work for that and I got to do a little bit of tweaking to it <clears throat> but for the most part if we set this right on top of there and if you look here got a spider web or something our we have very little play in which that is something that can work with and you see here I mean it works perfect now it does good up to about probably right about here so that means all I have to do <clears throat> and I'll show you where I think my problem is but if I'm down here this this is a little tight and I think what I'm gonna have to do <clears throat> is I'm gonna have to see it's not bad right here so I'm gonna probably have to go back flip this over I'm probably gonna have to <clears throat> grind this weld out this one and this one and pull this in probably about a sixteenth of an inch and the same thing down here on this side because I mean this is you can see that it's that it's hitting and I don't need it to be that tight as I'm trying to make these beams and stuff so I mean <clears throat> it's which is fine right here but I still have to go back drill some holes inside here everywhere one of those plates are at because what that's going to do that's going to attach to <clears throat> the top of a log and once I get one side milled I can roll the log over and roll over you know take this you know the, the rail system off roll the log over <clears throat> And go ahead fasten it down get my measurement where I want to cut the other side and go ahead and just mill it and this way I can wind up getting me uh, beams and stuff so but that's where I'm at with that right now I got to do a little tweaking on it but I'm gonna I'm going to wrap it up for the day because I've had <clears throat> it's been a long day <clears throat> but for the most part, I've gotten accomplished what I needed to get accomplished, get this put together. So it's just a matter of, you know, just tweaking a little bit. So I got those those three wells that I needed to go ahead <clears throat> and cut off. Or I might just make it simple, go along with a hammer <clears throat> and knock these in a little bit to where it does. And I might just do that instead. I'm, you know, that's probably what I need to do. So <clears throat> anyway, folks, that's where we're at. Um, I'm probably going to go ahead and when I get ready, I got one small uh, log that I might be able to do something with. If not, it's not a big deal. <clears throat> but um, we're going to go from there and we'll see what happens. As a matter of fact, I got a piece of cedar out there on the, um, in the driveway. I'm probably going to go ahead and try that on and see how it works. And um, 
then again i got some logs back here that just some scrap pine i could probably do something with anyway folks um if you like what you see go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button and um hit the bell so you're notified when i upload a new video so anyway folks um you take care and we'll talk to you later god bless